Well, hello there gamers, it's Bogusleek here. I'm faced with a new problem today. I've just tried to log on to Infestation. I'm trying to do a, a very genuine gameplay for you guys. And I come to find out that my account has been locked. Um, it says for a suspicious reason, but pff, all I've done is download the bl bloody thing. <laughs> I don't know what is going on with this, but to me it looks blurry. The words just don't look right. The picture looks fine. The picture looks fine. Um, it's ever since I changed from the old uploader to this one, and now I'm locked for no reason whatsoever. I'm going to try and update you as I'm going on. I'm going to try and reset my password, which is what it says me to do. So if you've got infestation, just reset your password and it should unlock your account. Uh, hopefully. Okay, I'll be right back gamers. Okay, welcome back gamers. Uh, yes, uh, it is the password problem that's causing this. If you have infestation, reset your password. It's something to do with your IP address. Once you log on with a different IP address or your computer ID changes, that's it. It locks you out for some reason. Which is quite frustrating really, especially if you're playing this game on one computer and then you want to transfer to your friend's computer and play it on there. Infestation, if you're watching this video, really consider changing that ruling because it's kind of daft really especially as you don't get multiple chances you only get one chance and that's it okay I'm going to let this download because it's got quite a bit to download and I don't want to be really talking all the way through this um, but yeah if you've got the infestation software just either reinstall it or reset your password. Those are the two main things it asks you to do. If you're still blocked after that, you are blocked because you've done something bad. Or you've crapped on the fella's lawn or done something that's pissed him off. Um, yeah, but oh, oh, just to let you know, guys know, yes, bogusleak.co.uk is back up and running. If you uh, registered with bogusleak.me.uk, that is closed. That is closed due to uh, a problem between me and the service provider. And um, I've moved across to the new one. Uh, the web uh, the web files are all updating at the minute, but you should be able to register within the next hour or so. So enjoy. Hi there gamers, this is Bogus Leak. I am joined today with Infestation. I'm going to create a survivor. Uh, he looks a severely happy chappy. Right, ex-military. Right, we'll just keep him like that, I think. Name is too short. What? What name? Oh. You know what? That'll do. Okay. <laughs> okay. I am not quite sure how well this will fare on my system. I am just below par on this game. Okay, skill tree. I have no idea what all this crap is. Play game. Trial server one, join server. Oh, uh, the updater doesn't really work all that well. Uh, I have noticed that, but it looks very clear, very nice on here. 
it's disregard m that guy you've just seen because the quality of him is caused by my computer okay let's have a look oh come on the loading on this is quite slow as well it survives around loading bars is that person in the middle a guy or a lass I have no idea and the one just on the right hand side shoulder looks like she's having a chat with someone I don't know whether that's just me <laughs> I don't know exactly how that chat is going to go down but oh come on today come on please just load for the loading bars I give this game a 2 out of 10 because it's doing murder. I know this is uh, a beta test well actually no it's a trial server but still bloody hell come on Holy crap, come on! You know a zombie will have come up and eaten me by now. Would have probably had dessert too. I don't exactly know what it's doing. Is it downloading the files? Is it transferring me to another server? It can't be reading the files, surely. Because my computer does very well at reading files. Oh my god! Come on! Oh my god, it's actually moving properly now. If you guys want to skip this bit, skip it. Because, um, seriously. Right, let's see how well this does on my computer. Uh, the specs are, you need a quad-core powered desktop or laptop with at least 4 gigs of RAM and I'm sure you expect the graphics card to be rather high and you are correct it takes rather high graphics card I'm not going to mention what that is because it varies on what mod, uh, make you have if you have Intel you're probably not going to be able to play this game Oh. Oh, there we go, there we go. Okay. No way is this an open world game. Yeah, disregard my graphics. This is the highest setting I can get it to without it freaking out. And this isn't too bad, to be honest.
That's quite nifty that. How do you turn it off? Oh, I like that. If you right click on your mouse, you can get him to look with the view. I'm sure with the higher settings, I'm going to replay this game on the higher settings on my Alienware. And I'm going to get this fully kitted. Because this looks like a very good game to play. There is a few bad points, of course. Like, where are you meant to go? And also everything feels very vulnerable. <coughs> I'm not going through the wind wilderness. Alright, I need to turn the flashlight off. How do you turn the flashlight off? Well, that's it. Right, I'm just going to have a look at controls. Options. Turn brightness down a bit. Primary fire, aim, move forward, move backwards. Interact, second interact. Y. I think that will be it. Nope, that's not it. Options. Yeah, uh, unfortunately when you start this game you're going to have to fiddle with a few settings just to... Okay, wait a minute. One. Oh, let's just keep the flashlight. Apparently he needs a flashlight. A few things that I see straight off that is not bad, it's more niggly things. Um, there's no real startup controls. So there's no indication of what controls you can use or have unless you go into the options and change them uh... there is no campaign from what i can see which would be a lot lot easier to work out this game if there was a campaign okay house Okay, let's head over to that dead creepy house. The one that looks like you're going to get murdered within two minutes of going into. That sounds like a logical idea, doesn't it? Yes, I am aware that my frame rate is quite, kind of low. It's the best I can do, especially with my recording kit recording at the same time. As you, as you remember, my laptop that I run most games off is a mid-range laptop. It's not a high performance machine. Because I feel that there is not m many high performance l machines out there. Really. I know reports are saying that they're on their, they're on their in increase. But I don't think so really. So far, this is dead boring. Oh! Do you see that? Two figures. Three! Four! Holy... F this shit just got real. Okay, okay. What do I do, what do I do, what do I do? I need to put this bloody torch away. Oh no! Come on!
handgun. Oh no! <laughs> I'm gonna have to leave it there, gamers. Uh, I used to go to the good bit and I can't do anything. Uh, my mouse has just decided that it's going to die on me. Um, I would not suggest using the laptop tracker pad to play this game. So, this has been Bogus Sleek. Uh, this is what you probably have seen so far from Infestation. If you want this game, uh, just search Infestation uh, on Google and it will probably be towards the top of the results. If you want to submit your own gameplay of this, then feel free and submit it in the comments below. Or if you want to submit it and just link me to it, that's fine. Uh, but you've been watching Bogus League. Game on.